What is up YouTube? This is DJ Phantom here, and today I'm going to be explaining the game mode Spike Rush. And when you play this game mode, first of all, there's limited time unless they're going to keep it around after this. And you also always play in this map. So, first thing to know is that it doesn't actually start until the kickoff happens. So as in, if you both whiff and the ball doesn't get touched, you don't get the spikes. But as soon as the ball gets touched, spikes are out, and they're infinite until you hit the ball. And then you have the option right there. As you, as you can see, you have the option to let go of the spikes and let the ball go anytime you want. Well, after like a second. And you'll see, probably, that that's going to cause a real problem in situations where you both hit the ball. And one person just gets it. It doesn't just like, oh, it goes to him and then goes to you. No, one person gets in for like a second, there's immunity. And that gets annoying sometimes. But one thing, one trick with the spikes is that at a certain point when you flick it and you let go, you can make the ball go a lot further than what it would really, what it would originally go. So that could be a strat that a lot of pros could use if they play this. And that's actually very helpful. Another thing is, as soon as you get hit the ball with your spikes and you actually get it all your boost goes immediately down to zero so best case to do is either just hit it when you're going fast or use your boost before you hit the ball so then you don't just you know run entirely out of boost and go at a slow speed and also um what is it what is it hmm i can't seem to think of something right now oh wait you can freaking break people's ankle. <laughs> Excuse me. You can break people's ankles with just flipping when you have the spikes. That got me so often when I was playing this with other people. It it made me so mad. We lost terribly. <laughs> but um, that's really it. And if you're like coordinated enough, you could have the ball on your spike and then flick it to your teammate. So then that uh they can grab it and then flick it to your other teammate and it could be like a whole passing play but watch out for as soon as you get it you might not be able to like take it from someone else immediately so that's all i wanted to say i was going to upload the other game but it wouldn't load for some reason so this is all i have but this is like a perfect example of what you could do with the spikes and also you can go and i think it was Cronofi that did it first with all the spike flips